Hi boys and girls, it's Mrs. Downey and James today. Hi. Today we're gonna play a game that you guys should remember in math though. It's called Counters in a Cup and it's the home version, okay? So it looks like this page I just showed you, but we're gonna practice using just a blank piece of paper. And I wrote down at the top, counters in a cup at home. We're gonna talk about how many counters are outside of your cup, how many are inside, and the total number we're using today is 10. So James and I have some Skittles. Yeah, some Skittles here. And we're gonna take out, uh, I'm gonna take out, James isn't really looking. I'm gonna take out this many and I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna move the camera so that you can see. And I put down, how many counters, James? I can't really see. Now you can look. How many are outside of the cup? Three. Three. So if there are three counters outside of the cup, James, how many counters do you think are in our cup? Seven. He thinks there's seven. So I'm going to watch James as he takes those counters out. He's going to put them on this side. And then I want you to count them, James, and see if your prediction was correct. So James says that there were three. He said that there were seven. And why did you say that, James? Why did you say that you thought there were seven inside of that cup? Because three plus seven equals ten. And there you go. Three plus something equals ten. And now I'm going to just move this back up. And I'm going to write that down. Oops, if I can. Oh, maybe it won't work, James. And... We're going to see if we were right. We know some of our combinations of 10. And 3 plus 7 does equal 10. Good job, James. So we're going to continue playing. We'll do one more round with you guys. Put those all back in the cup, James. And now I want you to take out some for me. And we're going to figure out that number plus another number. It's going to make a combination of 10. Let's see if we can do that. Yeah, do you want, you want, I'm not going to look. You just put down some counters outside of that cup. I'm not looking. All right, James took some counters out of that cup. Let me see what he's got there. He took out, let's count these. One, two, three, four five, six. So he has six counters outside of that cup. I know my combinations to 10 and I know you do too. I know James that six plus four equals 10. So let's see what's left over. Was he correct? Where, was I correct? How many are there boys and girls? Let's see. One, two, three, four. So was I correct, James, to say that six plus four equals 10? Yeah. Yes, I was. We also have a few more um, counters. So boys and girls, after you play this game, flip over your paper and we could add some more counters if you, you can find anything at home. You could use Skittles, you could use something else. You could use dried beans. Um, you could use erasers, whatever you have. I also have another five Skittles here. One, two, three, four, five. So that five plus 10 equals how many, James? 15. 15. So we already on the back row, counters in a cup. We said that now the total, oh, wrong side, Mrs. Downey. We said now the total is 15. So let's try this once, James. Are you ready? Take some out. I'm not looking. Do you want to do it? You don't want to do it? All right. So I'm going to take out some. James is going to close his eyes. All right, James, close your eyes. I've taken out, boys and girls, this many. Let's see if you can see them. Can you see them? All right, James, I took out how many? Four. Four. I took out four. 
So, James, now we're getting to 15. 4 plus what is going to give you 15? 11. He says 11, boys and girls. Let's see if he is correct. Oops. All right. Here's my board. There were the four. Let's dump these ones out. We lost a straggler here. All right. Let's count them, James. Ready? Will you count them for me? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So he said eleven. Four plus eleven equals fifteen. And were you correct, James? Yeah. Yeah. So here we go. We played also with 15. Now, I'm not going to play anymore. We're not going to play anymore. We want you guys to play. So here's your challenge. I want you to try to get a blank piece of paper because I know you don't have the board at home either. And I want you to find a cup, okay? And we want you to fill it with something that you can use as counters. And you can play this with somebody at home. And then when you're done, you can do what? He can eat them, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, he can eat the Skittles now. Okay, boys and girls? So play, not all of them, buddy. So play counters in a cup with a brother or a sister at home or your mom or your dad, okay? Hope you can remember this game. You should. I'll see you next time. Bye. Mm -hmm.